Hi friends, here in this video, I will be explaining the law of machine. Law of machine is the governing law for a simple machine in which we are getting the relation between the effort to be applied and the load to be lifted. And in, in order to explain this, I will draw a graph which would explain this law of machine. So here I would be plotting a graph between effort versus load. P is the effort which we are applying whereas W is the amount of load which we want to lift with the help of a simple machine. And here there is a line which is cutting this y axis at this location. So the distance between from the origin up to this height, it is denoted as C, which is called as the y intercept. And this line is a straight line. And here the equation of this line would be given as P is equal to M into W plus C and theta is the slope of this line. Now what we can understand from this graph is that when we are at the origin it means the load and effort values are zero but we can see that when the load is zero there is some amount of effort which is required because x value is 0 here but y is having a value which is c so it means even though the load value is 0 there is some amount of effort which is present and this much effort or the height c which shows the y intercept is the effort which is lost in overcoming the friction that is the load won't be lifted suddenly or at an instant in case of a simple machine some amount of effort is spent in overcoming friction that is denoted by C and after that the relationship is linear that is if we go on increasing the effort the load value increases so it becomes a linear relationship only after overcoming the effort C. Now if this line would have passed through the origin then C value would have been 0 and such a case is present in case of an ideal machine in which the friction is not present. So that is the case of an ideal machine and here which I am explaining that is an actual machine. So the equation of this line is P is equal to M into W plus C which is nothing but this equation is called as the law of machine. So here I will write down that law of machine denoted or given by the equation P is equal to M into W plus C and here P is the effort applied which we are applying. Now effort can be in terms of Newton or in terms of kilonewton. Then M is the slope of the line given by tan theta and theta can be explained in this way like here there is distance x1 and this is distance x2 on the horizontal axis similarly on the vertical axis here we have y1 and this is y2 so tan theta would be basically equal to the opposite side which is y2 minus y1 and adjacent side which is x2 minus x1. So by using this concept we can get theta and once theta is known the slope can be calculated and vice versa. Then w is the load to be lifted. 
unit of W either in terms of Newton or kilo Newton. This C is called as Y intercept. And even this effort is having a unit of Newton or kilo Newton. Now, once we know the law of machine from this, if the value of effort is given, we can find the value of load. And if the value of load is given, we can find the value of effort. And as explained below, this is the graph which I had drawn for an actual machine. If it would have been an ideal machine, it would have started from this origin. And here the y-intercept would have been zero. So the moment we apply effort, load gets lifted without any friction. So this is a line or law of machine for an ideal machine. Whereas the one which I had drawn above that is for an actual machine. So this law of machine would be very helpful while solving the problems related to simple machines. At the end, if you all find my videos helpful, you all can like, share, comment and subscribe our channel and share it amongst your family and friends. Thanks for watching.